Hey Gabby, I'm Marquette with Home Soul Real Estate. Thanks for meeting with me today. Thank you so much for coming in. So those of you that don't know, Gabby is the lead project manager and designer at Clay Imports, and we're super excited to be here today. Clay Imports provides this just beautiful custom handmade tile that you source from all over the world, and it really gives people an opportunity to have a bespoke sort of distinctive touch to their home, I think. Absolutely. Do you mind showing us some of the pieces? So this is one of my personal favorites. We have the zipper, interlocking shape, fun pattern, nice way to bring in color. Um, simple, but still, you know, a statement piece. Absolutely. The stone textile line is incredible. Elizabeth Mullen designed this entire series off of her fabrics and wallpapers, and we've turned it into a tile line. Wow. Brand new, just being launched this month. It'd be really helpful, I think, for our real estate clients to learn a little bit more about the process. Do you have some time to chat about that? Yeah, of course. Let's face it, decorative tile is totally having a moment in interior design, right? Yeah, thank God it's making a comeback. Yes, it is, <laughs> in a big way, because I was really wanting to visit with you about how clay imports can help them add that special touch to their house. It's so nice to be able to get away from the subway tile and actually bring in color and design and just that element into any space, whether it's a bathroom, a kitchen, or even a porch. I mean, you can just add tile and it's amazing what it can do. Well, and all of this stuff is handmade. Where do you source all this beautiful tile from? Everything that we have is imported from Mexico, Morocco, Turkey, and Vietnam. All handmade, responsibly sourced. We're very big on the, the fabricators that actually make our tile and how this material is being produced. If someone walked in and they said, hey, I've got this house that I've just bought, I wanna, you know, add a special touch to it. What would the process be like working with you? We really go about it a lot of different ways. One of the most basic ways is someone will come in, bring their plans and say, hey, like this is an inspiration of what I'm kind of wanting to do. We'll feel it out. Start from the drawing board, pick out five to 10 maybe different tiles and ideas, narrow it down from there. And we have an amazing graphic designer who can actually make a rendering of what your tile would look like in that space. Other times when people come in and totally blank slate and they will, um, center everything else around that tile. What's that process timeline look like? Like how long does the design process take? It can be anywhere from a day where someone will come in, we'll pick everything out that exact same day to a year long process where we'll pick everything out room by room, space by space. We're all over the board with that. If someone was going to choose a handmade tile, just in the production of the tile itself, I mean, what's the turnaround time on a bespoke piece like that? Or yeah. and do you even carry anything in stock? Like what are the choices? We have a lot of material here in stock. So it's always a good option that if you need something right away, we will have something here for you. If you want to go the complete custom route, that's always an option as well. We're looking at a 10 to 12 week lead time, worst case scenario. Well, you were visiting with me a little bit earlier about a custom project that you're working on now. Tell us about that one. So we have a customer, her grandfather was from Cuba, immigrated to the United States, didn't bring much with him, no pictures, just whatever he could fit in a suitcase. And she actually had cousins and family members that had scanned these pictures and sent them to her. And looking back, she found this amazing cement tile that was on a patio in that home. She approached us with the pictures and we made a custom mold for her and we produced that cement tile and it is going to be installed on her sun porch. Such a special way of taking that piece of family history and modernizing it and bringing it from Cuba and giving her that family connection. I mean, it's really special when we are able to incorporate that into someone's home, bringing that piece of the family into it, your, your roots, you know? Well, you mentioned cement tile. For those of us that are tile novices, what are the different kinds of tile that you carry and, and what does someone need to know yeah. when they're making a tile decision? We have our very, very traditional Saltillo tile, which we have also expanded and we have began to glaze it and fire it. So it's gonna be a more durable, somewhat of a more modern take on the traditional Saltillo. Then we have our clay tile, which is gonna be the very clean, straight lines, um, subways, decorative patterns, but we also have our Talavera with that. And then cement is going to be, uh, it's a different process. It's a water cured tile. The way a cement tile patinas over time is just beautiful. You've been working here for how many years now? Three. <laughs> okay, I have to ask, because I'm like, I want to take everything home with me as I look around the studio. Do you have a favorite tile? So I have taken some of my ideas and I've put them on tiles. Um, I love the interlocking shapes and patterns and being able to apply a solid color, but breaking it up with a pattern. So the zipper is definitely my favorite. Clean lines, but something fun, just. And that's one of your design. It is. You're not yeah. gonna find that anywhere else no. but here at Clay Imports. That's right. Now that's bespoke, you guys. Thanks for joining us today. Now back to you in the studio.